So while raising a baby, an infant, you accumulate a lot of garbage from all the food that they eat. And so I decided, since spring is coming up, to make a few set of planters for the seedlings I wanted to start in my garden. And the first one I'm going to do is a formula can. The indoor planters we're using right now are large, clunky, don't really have drainage holes in them. I like the idea of these better because they're a lot smaller and a lot more mobile. I can transfer them around the house a lot easier if I, they need more sun or if they need a different position in the house. And I wanted to use these for just a small little herb garden inside my house during the winter when I want to add some fresh herbs to my cooking. Okay, there's the crown. Can you color it in? Uh, yeah. Yeah? Okay. Red. Ooh, it's a red crown? Yeah. Yeah. This is above this crown. And as you can see, I have my wonderful little helper here to help me just decorate the planters just a little bit to make them seem a little more homey. But after we were done with that, I decided to drill some holes with a quarter inch bit in the bottom. I think four holes would be good enough to get accurate drainage out of it. And then we will get them planted soon. And the second thing was these plastic baby food containers that had a lot of pureed baby food in it, and I want to use those as seedling starts. My husband came up with a nifty idea to use a block to anchor the containers and just nail in holes with the nail. And I kind of made a little bit of a template with myself after doing it six times each. They're pokey. Yeah, the hammer is pokey, huh? No. The nail, sorry, the nail. You're right. The nail. The nail is pokey. And, and the nail is done. Don't do this, but with that. Yep. Yeah, you don't want to miss your finger, right? Because it'll get through your finger alleys. Yeah. Yeah. Mom. Whoa, it's getting, it's getting bigger and bigger. One more, last one. Look how big the tower is. Yes! It's a method is using some newspapers. You're going to plant in the newspapers and then plant the entire thing, newspaper included, into the garden when your seedlings are ready. I've had success with this in the past and after collecting newspapers for a few months now I have quite a bit to make some planters out of and I was able to knock them out really fast with just um, within a couple minutes I was able to get like three or four out. So it was a fun time just spending time with my kids, having them helping me out, making these things, little pictures on their uh, planters, and then I just got to talk and have fun. Look, look at how strong I am, Baba. You are so strong. I'm really with these big muscles. Look at all of these. High five. Thank you for helping me. 